So welcome again, parents. Thank you for coming out tonight on a blustery evening. Welcome Santa Ana winds. They're actually here. It's not too hot, so that's good. How many parents do I have from Durfee? Let me see my Durfee parents. Awesome. How about Rio Hondo? Where are Rio Hondo parents? Do I have any uh, Frank Wright parents? Where are Frank Wright? Yes, that's my alma mater. That's where I went to school. Seventh grade, Frank Wright. And what about Gidley? Do I have any Gidley parents? Yes, Gidley parents. Any Madrid parents? Any Madrid parents? There they are. So you guys know what this stuff's all about. You guys do parades. Awesome. Well, again, thank you. Uh, I hope you enjoy this. Uh, we used to do a football game, and none of our football games this year are occurring in November. In fact, our last one is tomorrow, and it's a homecoming game, so it's a completely different format than a typical football game. It wouldn't really be conducive for this type of event. So I like that we're all here together and you guys can interact and talk to the Arroyo parents. Where are Arroyo parents? Let me see you. Where are you at, Arroyo parents? So those people with their hands that just went up. Eighth grade parents, you need to say hi and introduce yourself. We have some fundraising things coming up. We have some important meetings coming up. We'd love for you guys to start getting your feet wet and attend those events. Okay, so right now we would like to have a concert with all of the eighth grade students and the Arroyo students in a combined mass concert. You're looking at, this is what 200 musicians looks like, so take a picture. That's 200 musicians on the field right now. Let's give them a big hand for coming out tonight. Okay, the first song we're going to play tonight is Starships. on the radio last summer. It's Uma Thurman. And this one is a little faster. This one's an up-tempo song, so we need our drum line to really watch and stay together.
remember the Munsters. Yes. So all the parents, I tried to tell them about the Munsters. These kids don't know. They don't know what it is. I had to find a YouTube video. And then they're like, oh, that's neat. Why is it in black and white? There's no color. The kids didn't understand. But now, see, we're bringing culture to the children. It's, and just in time for Halloween, so kills two birds. All right, turn the speaker towards the kids for a second. All right, eighth grader, outstanding job. That was really, really good. Give yourselves a hand. And now it is our turn to perform for you. So eighth graders, come up in here into the stands in the center. Ben, get dressed and set at the top of the show. direct your attention to the south end of the track. We would now like to present the Arroyo Knights Band and Color Guard in their parade performance of the Purple Carnival March. That's our military tradition. So thank you, everybody, so much for coming out tonight. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope you found that it was informative about what your kids will be doing next year at Royal High School. We look forward to seeing you. I will be coming down to your school in February with the band to perform and get everybody all excited to register when they sign up for classes. This class basically is called Senior Band. If your student doesn't feel they're ready for senior band, then they can sign up for junior band, and we will instruct them on how to be ready, become ready for senior band. But most of the kids make it into senior band, and uh, we give them all the information about what that entails, 
when they come to the meeting in June. So the meeting in June is a mandatory meeting that guarantees that your son or daughter will have a spot in the show that we're going to do next year, which we don't know what it is yet. But whichever show we pick for next year, if you want to make sure your son and daughter has a spot in either the color guard, the band, or the drumline, then that June meeting, the first Tuesday in June, is imperative that you attend and place your deposit to hold their spot so they can be a part of this program for the next year. So again, thank you. Thank you, junior high school directors, Bethany Anderson, Maureen Henderson, Suzanne Brown, Dave Carden. Thank you guys for bringing your kids out on school night. We really appreciate it. Feel free to go. Thank you and have a good evening.